Roblox Souls RNG Era 8 Progress is like a ghost town. But it's about to be five weeks since the Era 7 update. Where is it? But there is one thing which caught my eye. And that's the Aura Cutscene Reworks 1 out of 2. So today, I'm going to go on a hunt to find the best Aura Cutscene Reworks to see what could potentially be added. And I'm guessing one of them is going to be a Star Scourge Radiant Cutscene because this current one... Yeah, it's so bad. But you know what isn't bad? All the people with the name Noodle Look is real. We continue to grow with over 7,400 subscribers cooking with their extra bonus look. But to help you cook, as always, I'm giving away five game passes on this video. All you have to do is leave a like, comment down below your username, and of course, subscribe. So if you want to join the five previous winners, keep hitting that subscribe button like it's the roll button. Today, we are going to be looking at all the cutscene reworks. And why are we doing that? Well, because in the Era 8 progress, Juice's place has put Aura Cutscene Rework 1 out of 2. So you know what that means. There are definitely going to be some nice cutscene reworks coming very soon. And I'm not going to lie, we have covered this before, but I found some even better cutscenes. And if you don't believe me, I'm going to stop yapping and just check this out. My best Bloodlust cutscene concept by me, Josty. Brackets me. Huh? I said that so wrong. But it's by Josty. And I'm not going to lie, I got excited and clicked this already. And look, two days spent and he cooks this. Are you ready? Just watch this. Look at that. That is so good. Your blood. What does that say? I have no idea, but this is so cool. Insane. You know what? Since I'm not using Heavenly 2s right now, and I've currently got 5 plus 4 Celestials, 7 Heavenly 2s, let's not use them until we get the new cutscenes and hopefully cook them. Imagine how hype it would have been to see that. I love the detail on the hands there. And then wait, there was more, right? The gates at the bottom. Honestly, one of the coolest cutscenes I think I've ever seen. But wait, it doesn't end there. Josty might be the new goat of cutscene concepts. Next, we have a chromatic Genesis cutscene concept by Josty. He didn't put me this time, but we all know he's the chef. So let's have a look here and wait. There's a train. It says here, stay, wake. It's got all the words from the aura. Worry. And that is just the cleanest cutscene I think I've ever seen. He is just the goat. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like the normal Chromatic Genesis cutscene is already kind of clean. This train is just really cool. It reminds me of something of an anime. Well, it doesn't end there again. Joe Steam might have one more in his locker. And that is the Souls RNG, a flashy oppression cutscene concept by Joe Steam. We definitely need an oppression cutscene. But did bro cook? Also, edit to noodle here just to give you an epilepsy warning this does flash a lot so if you don't like that feel free to skip this one but it is very cool so here it is and straight away there's actually a star i'm not sure if i was the biggest fan of the subtitles at the bottom but this kind of fits souls rng a little bit more i love the heartbreak oh wait this is cool into a triple heartbreak oh wait there's the avatar wait this is insane Oh my god, okay, that flashes a lot. Yo, wait a second. That was actually really insane. This guy is really talented. Only three custom cutscenes and he's cooked that hard. But it doesn't end there. There is more people who can make amazing cutscenes. And the next is Colon Dupe. And if you remember the video about a week ago, he made the other oppression cutscene concept. But look, he made a cutscene for natural. Fan made star cutscene, natural mutation. What has bro cooked here? Wait, that's actually clean. Wait, this is very nice. It doesn't quite fit Souls because it's too high quality, but I like that a lot. Very clean. But what the hell is the mutation for natural? The colon dupe also has a lot of crazy cutscenes as well. Check this next one out and oh, we just got a corruption. Give me an impeached. Star Scorch Radiant fan made cutscene. This is the one we needed because we all know the original cutscene looks identical to the normal Star Scorch. Like, what is this? And then a title just pops and it says Star Scorch Radiant at the top. Has everyone been having? star scores jump scares recently but let's check this out straight away it is a new star it's in a cave oh wait the crystals just all linked up 
Wait, that was insane. The creativity on that, I love this part. The way the three crystals link together and the icon in the background was perfect as well. I think the other Star Scourge Radiant cutscene we covered in the past was a little bit cleaner and matched Souls RNG, but I just love the creativity on this and the sound effects. It's beautiful. We definitely know a Star Scourge Radiant cutscene is gonna happen, but which one will it be? Or will they cook an entirely new one? But now I've got something even cooler for you to check. This is the Blossom Aura cutscene revamp Souls RNG by Souls G. I've not actually seen this guy's channel before, but will he cook? And here it is. Wait, that's clean. That's kind of like the Sovereign one. And then he's got the petals coming down. Ooh, the icon. Yeah, I like that a lot. Very clean. Also, I'm low-key jealous that bro has Blossom. I was one Celestial away. Not like this. But speaking about auras I don't have, here's an Overture History cutscene concept by Daker. And this is insanely clean. Bro's got like 3D hourglasses going up. And the text? That was actually probably one of the best reworks we've seen because it looks like it would actually fit Soul's RNG as well. I love the transition from blue to green. Do you know what it could have done? The hourglass which falls in could have filled the screen as it goes along and makes the color change. That would have made it a little bit smoother, but that is very nitpicky. And if you couldn't execute that correctly, it would probably look worse. This was a really clean rework or revamp of the cutscene. So I'm not going to lie. I'm not just saying this because I don't have Overture, but the Overture cutscene is kind of mid. Why does it twinkle like stars? I do have another cutscene concept for an aura I don't have. This is making me sound like I'm cooked. I do want to stress that I'm not cooked. These reworks just happen to be on auras I don't have. But you know what? At the same time, it means when I do get them, they could have a very cool cutscene because check out this gargantua one. All right, here it is. He's rolling it. Ooh. Wait. This looks like a cutscene for the rarest display aura. And the icon as well. Boom. Bro absolutely killed it on that one. And wait, I did just get null. No controller needed. Easy, heavenly one. And that's my dailies completed. Just like that. We take those. I don't know when era eight is, but we're gonna have so many heavenly twos. I cannot wait. And wait, it just switched to hell. Do you know what was a period which felt like hell? Undead jump scares. Well, imagine someone did a revamp for the undead star. Let me just tell you, this ain't gonna look like a Matrix one. So we have Souls RNG undead cutscene concept by Max. So let's have a look at what bro cooked. Wait, that's kind of like a glitch. I like the emblems. And wait a second. That cut off really abruptly. It just went into a black screen. It's literally like this aura is so bad. You don't want it. And then just skipped. Well, do you know what else is really bad? I'm going to take a quick break from the cutscenes. But check out Era 8 progress. Goose has now added final exams 19 days left. Are you for real? When is era eight, bro? I actually don't believe it. Please tell me it's at least next week. What do I even do? Do I start just doing flex battles until I lose? Wait, I could do that. And if I lose, I'll give away. I'll let you decide that. But anyway, enough yapping. I'm going to equip my oppression depression and have a look at some more cutscenes. Layers cutscene concept made on a mobile geometry dash. Wait, people are actually cooking these crazy cutscenes on mobile bro what let's see if bread damnation has cooked i can't believe this is made on mobile let's check it out what this is possible a geometry dash nah subscribe i mean if you subscribe to me i'll subscribe to you but bread Nation, that was insane especially since it was made on mobile what the hell so bread Nation actually made a hypervolt cutscene as well i'm not gonna lie if i show you my inventory i probably would have seen that cutscene too many times i'd be dreaming about it just look at this that is how many hypervolts i have i have 10 of these goofy hypervolts bro i used to love this aura now i hate it for real i don't actually hate it one thing i hate is that they remove the old obby so the beams don't look anywhere near as cool where's the high spot which isn't the mountain where i can just chill on so let's check it out last time i made a cutscene for souls rng i was pretty happy with it and since my voting poll literally got zero votes i am doing hypervolt wait that's actually pretty clean oh there's the beams I can't believe that was made in mobile. That's crazy. Do a lot of people actually make their auras in Geometry Dash? Surely not, right? I have seen a few people comment it though. And here is another one. I made a oppression cutscene concept. Let's have a look. Let's see what bro cooked on his mobile. Wait. 
There is no way this is mobile. It doesn't fit Soul's RNG, but the sinking was insane. Be sure to check that guy out and give him some votes on his poll. I feel bad if he gets none. There is one channel I want to go back and check out though, and that is Daker. Because they've also done a layers cutscene concept, and they said, I don't know, I don't really like it. Let me be the judge of that. So the star's pretty clean. Ooh. Wait. This might be the best. Wait, that definitely is. That was the best cutscene concept for that ugly aura. It's not ugly, I'm just coping since we'll never be able to get it. And they have one more cutscene concept, which is the glitch. I'm not gonna lie, I got really hyped when I saw the original glitch cutscene. Well, not the original one, the one in this update. But is this one gonna be even better? Epilepsy warning. Even that flashed out. Wait. This is cool. What? Wait, I love the detail how he added this. I'm not gonna lie, I always thought it was weird that you had an exclamation mark on your head in a triangle. But at least this cutscene kind of gives it some sense. Really cool though. It's a shame I lost my two glitch auras. But you know what? That doesn't matter. We are waiting till era eight now. We have officially joined the era eight waiting room. I just need a sovereign so I can sit down and watch everyone else cook with that noodle look. <laughs>